I went to work in a cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I went to work in a cotton mill, and this is all I heard. Hello, welcome to Making Music. I do hope you've been enjoying the sessions. Please continue to like, share, subscribe, tell your friends, tell your neighbours, tell anybody about it. Um, I want as many people to get the benefit of these sessions as possible. Thank you very much. In today's session we're going to be learning all about singing and body percussion and we're going to be inspired by the area where I live, Lancashire. I went to work in a cotton mill. Where I live in Lancashire you'll see lots of old buildings with tall chimneys. These buildings were once cotton mills, big factories where people made textiles. They were noisy, dangerous, dirty places to work, filled with big machines that weave cotton to make cloth. Children as young as seven would have to work up to 15 hours a day in the mills for not very much money. First of all, we need to learn the song. So the words are, I went to work in a cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I went to work in a cotton mill and this is all I heard. Okay? And then it's pretty much the same each verse. The melody is the same. That means the selection of different pitched notes is pretty much the same. The only difference is you're going to change the lyrics. That means you're changing the words, but not a lot. I went to work in a cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I went to work in a cotton mill and this is all I heard. So the second verse is, I worked so hard in the cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I worked so hard in the cotton mill and this is all I heard. I worked so hard in the cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I worked so hard in the cotton mill and this is all I heard. And then the third verse is, 15 hours in the cotton mill, cotton mill cotton mill 15 hours in the cotton mill and this is all i heard that 15 hours refers to those children that had to work 15 hour days not very good 15 hours in the cotton mill cotton mill cotton mill 15 hours in the cotton mill and this is all i heard and then finally the last verse is a repeat of the first verse again so that's easy enough i went to work in a cotton mill once you've got the hang of the song, the next bit is to have a go at doing some of the body percussion bits. So the first one goes after the first verse. So once you've fung sung the first verse and you've gone, uh, and this is all I heard, this is the bit that you need to learn. So put one hand out here like this and put your fist up like this and then you're going to put your fist slowly down into your palm and make a shh sound. So shh. And then on beat number two, you're going to slam your hand down onto your palm like this. So it's got to make a kind of big slapping sound. So, shh. Okay. Shh. Okay. So starting like this. Shh. And then a clap. So one, two, three. Shh. Followed by, on beat number four, a stamp of the foot. So it goes one, two, three, stamp. All right, and you repeat that four times. Maybe practice that a few times first. After verse two, that's I worked so hard in the cotton mill, you have a different bit of body percussion to do. And what you're gonna do is two stamps, then two taps on your thigh, followed by two stamps again. So it sounds like this. Stamp, stamp, tap, tap, stamp, stamp. Try that really slowly. Stamp, stamp, tap, tap, stamp, stamp. Okay, let's do it again slowly. Stamp, stamp, tap, tap, stamp, stamp. And then finally, a clap at the end. And it's quite fast, this. I'll do it slowly again, and then we'll speed it up. Stamp, stamp, tap, tap, stamp, stamp, clap, again.
Okay, I hope you got that. If not, you can go back a bit, practice it again, and then come back. Did you notice that I actually sped up the tempo a little bit then? It started quite slow tempo and gradually it got a little bit faster. It's good when you're learning something in music to always practice it really slowly. After verse 3, you're going to be tapping your chest and saying the words cotton and cloth. Like this, cotton and cloth. So actually you're, go you're going to be tapping your chest and clapping your hands to the syllables, that's the beats of the word. Cotton has two syllables, so you tap your chest twice. Cotton and cloth. Cotton and cloth. Cotton and cloth. Cotton and cloth. Try it. Cotton and cloth. 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 Obviously, you don't want to be banging your chest so hard you give yourself bruises. That's not a good thing. Just do it softly, all right? Cotton and cloth. Cotton and cloth. Cotton and cloth. Cotton and cloth. And then for the final verse, the body percussion you're going to be doing is the shh again. Four times just to finish. So we're going to have a try at putting all of these different things together, see how it sounds. If you make a mistake, it doesn't matter. This is not a test. This is just good fun. I went to work in a cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I went to work in the cotton mill, and this is all I heard. I worked so hard in the cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I worked so hard in the cotton mill, and this is all I heard. Fifteen hours in the cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. Cotton and cloth, 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 cotton and cloth. I went to work in the cotton mill, cotton mill, cotton mill. I went to work in the cotton mill, and this is all I heard. Okay, that's all we've got time for for today. Take care.